Hey guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to to episode 10 of the Helpful Fox Senko Sun. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. It's too bright. What's up? Snow. Oh, snow! <laughs> I was about to say, hold on, wasn't it just like, what, summer? That's the difference between a little kid and an adult. <laughs> Cody, did you just get closer? My God, don't do that. <laughs> I, I love my dog, but then I hate him. He scares me sometimes. <laughs> He's worse than my previous dog. Oh my God. He don't say anything if he just moves closer. But yes, that is the difference between a child who is, well, no, a woman who is 800 years old, that dog got closer, and acts like a child, and a man, and who's just like, uh. But see, here in Florida, we don't have snow. Thank God. But the worst thing about not having snow here in Florida, you don't have snow days. And honestly, when I moved back here, I missed I mean, it gets cold here, like it does in Nebraska, but, like, it has its wind chill, and then, but there's never ice, no snow, you can't wear no heavy coat, girls out here wearing some damn shorts in the cold, and then two, three days later, they're sick, and I'm like, wow, stupid. <laughs> You got closer. Cody, what is wrong with you? Because <laughs> hmm? he's got to go to work. Well, he has to. No. Yeah. Hi. Oh, I... Huh? And then she'll be alone. Come on, stay home. Call in sick. Hmm? Yay! Okay, now you can either go play or you can go to sleep. Me, go to sleep. <laughs> Don't you want to go? I mean, what if you get sick? Did you just cry? Oh, 
a line. Exactly. Yeah, but don't fall asleep. <laughs> they, holy shit, Cody! Did they really do the dog thing? <laughs> Hi, honey. <laughs> yeah. You okay? You okay? You got hiccups? <laughs> you right? Oh, yeah, you do have the hiccups! Oh, it's okay! <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, oh my god, puppy. <laughs> Here, let me help. Oh my god. You poor baby. <laughs> oh. Chill. It's okay. <laughs> I can't stop laughing at him. Uh, just go. Still don't get it. Your hair goes to go away. Are you okay? Did you hurt your back? You want to go put a heating pad on it or, you know, 
take a nice hot bath. You better? What? Uh, yeah. Here you go, Cody. You just you won all the lovings. Gotta feel bad for her though. Damn. <laughs> well, that's what you get. You didn't wear a coat. Okay, you gotta go back over there, dude. And you hopped down and you came back over. I'm almost done, boo. I just got another half. I got 12 minutes left, and then I will take you out. Beach. Beach. Her fucking name is Sora. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, well, well, dang, we going BDSM now? I'm a little shocked. <sighs> okay. Makes sense.
Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know, I'm babe. Mm-hmm. So good enough sleep. Mm, nothing. Okay. We still love you. Well, you didn't say what she looked like. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's okay, you're 800 years old. It's still fine to be jealous of someone else. Well, either that or if you touched your boobs, you still would have been jealous. Because she has, what, what, like, nine tails? And she only has one Come here, I'm almost done. <laughs> Did you really have to run over here, weirdo? I'm almost done. Uh. Of course! Damn. Of course, you're still watching. Sora, what you mean by that? We got like what two, three episodes left, and I don't think it's gonna probably be explaining whatever she said and what not said meant by that. But I mean, now after knowing what the hell her name is and fully seeing her, I, I really was shocked. I, I I didn't think that she would have been in this episode. I'm thinking like, okay, it's just gonna be a regular old episode. 
with the two of them. No, um, it was a little funny just to have Jess go in for like a second. No shit at all. Everything would have been fine. Just these two beginning to end. That's it. But to have her come in out of nowhere and just pop in and like say hi. <laughs> God, I hate when they do that. Like, I just choked. Ew. Um, was really strange. And like I said a couple of weeks ago when she first popped up, she is very mysterious, even till now. But she's just that type of girl, or not even girl, woman who just likes to flaunt her body. You know, most of us are really like that. You know, when we have a body, we're just like, fuck it. But <laughs> I love how we got It's just so protective. Like, no. He's the only one that I can only cut him with my tail, not yours, not Shiddo's, mine. Like, mm -hmm, get a little jealousy over there, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but it's okay to be jealous. You know, you're 800 years old. You, you don't have this, but you have fluff. <laughs> Poor baby, oh my gosh. Nigga. Uh. I just froze. <laughs> Come here, Cody. No, Cody? Okay. Well, dang, that one was short. I thought it was going to be a little bit longer. But, yeah, so she's interesting. A little secretive, but interesting. And, I mean, she since she's now officially here and she's shown herself a lot more, I think with these last, like, what, two, three episodes I think we have left with this show, um, we're going to learn a little more about her. And, plus, I just want to know what she meant by what she said. Something bad is coming. We're now about to go into, like, the Kobayashi arc, where we had all this cute, happy, warm stuff, and then these next few episodes might take a turn for the worse, and something bad might happen, whether it is to Dude or Senko herself or any one of these characters. But you just, when you have that weird feeling and something doesn't seem right, it's gonna come. I don't know how, but... It's, it's coming, and I'm kind of scared, and I don't want anything bad to happen, especially with these last few episodes, because we're almost done. I just, I want this show to end nice, calm. Give me a nice, good Kobayashi ending. Don't give me an ending where I'm just like, why? <laughs> just give me an ending that's just going to satisfy me. Do a We Cross ending where it's, I mean, I, I kind of said this with, like, Shield Hero and, like, if they end it with a cliffhanger, but make it more more so, like, an open ending where we can kind of interpret, like, what we think might happen next until you read the manga and such, because I don't even know how close the anime is to the manga counterpart for it, or even how many chapters the manga has, because if this show were to get a second season, as, like, I've said with other shows countless times, like, I said it for freaking Girls Last Tour, but unfortunately that ain't gonna get the second season because um, people told me that they're so close to it that they're, they would only be able to do, like, one or two episodes for it. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. I'm like, let me just go cry in the corner, but it's okay. I mean, with this series, I would like to know more. I feel like there's a lot more lore base with this show and... Not only with the comedy and the heartwarming, uh, cutesy stuff, there is something else hidden down there. So if it got a second season, I would like to see a little bit more things with it, but I don't know. I mean, yeah, but so is interesting. Sexual, but interesting. And I mean, I'm hoping that with these next two, three episodes, we get to see her a little bit more. But yeah, it's a good episode. I like the snow. The snow was just cute. Seeing them both play, like, mmm. I'm happy he got a fucking day off. He needed a day off. Like, damn. It's just, like, as someone who works a lot doing this and then taking care of things, like, I understand because I don't go to bed till really late and then I wake up really, really late in the day and I am tired as hell and I don't want to do anything. I know how he feels and, like, I just, you need a day to get some good behind sleep. 
chill, relax. Hell, I need a day where I can go, like, I can take a really good nap and just chill out and zen and not have to, like, always worry about recording-ish. But I think that's coming up in a couple weeks. I think my mom wants to go somewhere. I'm not really 100% sure. I, I don't really know. I mean, probably when I'm on my vacation, I will still probably be working and such. But, yeah, I don't know. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episode 10 of the Helpful Fox Senko san If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Metro Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode 11. Bye!